Hey there LEGO fans, Mesba here, welcome to Mesbricks. Today I have a very small set, the 40517 Vespa. So there are two Vespas currently being sold on LEGO. This is the smaller one in Canada, it only costs $12.99 plus tax. So I got this with some VIP points and now I'm going to build it. You can see the LEGO Creator Surf Shop right there and we'll get to it at another video. So for now, let me build and review this Vespa. And here it is, the Vespa. Nice red, travels smoothly. Now, as you may have noticed, this is definitely not minifig scale. So I'm putting this minifigure right next to it, just so you can understand how big this is. The minifig, of course, does not come with this set. This is actually the very first time I made a set that is not minifig scale. I usually don't buy vehicles that are not minifig scale, so I don't really have any of those creator expert cars. But I wanted this because I am I have some nostalgia towards the Vespa. Our family used to have one when I was growing up. I'd ridden it lots of times behind, you know, my older cousins and so on. So I wanted the Vespa. Now the blue Vespa, the big one is $120 or more. This one is $12.99 in Canada. So I wanted to get this one. I would have preferred this in blue, but the small one comes in red. This little instruction booklet, let's talk a little bit about it. For some reason, now the cover is very nice. It shows some places in Italy. I would guess this is Florence and so on. For some reason, my copy, the material seemed to be of very poor quality, as is the printing. It almost was a non-Lego instruction, the way it appeared. But you know, maybe I just got a bad copy, so I'm not gonna dwell too much on it. What I want to talk about first is some of the things that I don't like about this set. Now, yes, this is a $12.99 set, so just $12, I shouldn't complain too much, but still. Those are the extras, does come with a very small sticker set, three stickers. But still, there are so many things that I don't like about it. Number one, this seat. So I don't know how they would have made this seat, but it does not look good. See, it sticks out, first of all. The real seat on the Vespa, you know, the padded look, I don't think this captures it well. It's kind of not blocky but sharp and not as smooth and then you have this little bit showing there this now let's go to the bottom now in the real vespa this is all of course one build here you see this little gray silverish pedal showing now on the real vespa there is some grating here you can put your foot in so it's not as flat, but still, you can see from the bottom, it doesn't look that great. I don't think there's pedals there like this, so this could have been done differently. This is a clip, as you can see. This clip is not that visible because they used a black attachment for it. So I don't know how else they could have done it, but this sort of things being visible does not look that great. There is also the matter of the front sticker. Let me see if I can focus it. Here it is, Vespa. And you can see that the color of the sticker and the color of the bricks is slightly different. Now, in none of the, let me take the model. Here it looks as if it's the same color. But when you compare the real deal, it's not. You can see very clearly that the color of the sticker and the color of the bricks is very, very different. There's also one final thing, all Vespas used to come with a kickstand. So, you know, you would park your Vespa, you would throw the kickstand and it would be like this and that's how you leave it. Here, you have to sort of keep it balanced like that and very easily it can tip over. So if you're displaying it somewhere, make sure you don't shake it. I would have loved a small kickstand, maybe, you know, a another clip attachment to this. Could have been done something, I'll see if I can do something in the meanwhile maybe from one of those extra pieces that come with the set but again 
there is no kickstand with it so those are some of the things that I don't like about this now this is a small model so I, I am going to pick three things that I do like about the set but I'm not gonna rank them I'm just gonna tell you what those three things are the best is that the front look so this light the curving of the front the two handlebars this has been captured very well this is the Vespa look and I think this set does it pretty well the second thing is the wheels attachment so you can see if I bring it in closer the way the wheels are attached to the assembly both in the back and the front the angle that it makes that's great again the look of the Vespa is captured properly with the wheels and the final thing is the overall look from three sides this looks great and again let me balance it so it looks great from here looks great from the side and again as you can see what happens when you don't have a kickstand it looks great from this side it does not look great if you turn it around like that and that's because of this silverish or gray 2 by 8 bar this shouldn't have been there they could have made this in red which would have been nice and an inverse slope could have been used here and a sticker for some of the instruments speedometer or whatever the you know, fuel gauge so none of those things are there again i realize this is a 12.99 set but how much would it have been to make this in red and put an inverted slope here with a sticker so those are that's what is missing in this set would you buy this set? Would I recommend you to buy this set? Absolutely, if you have a nostalgia for a Vespa, because you're not gonna get something in this scale all the time. So since one became available, I bought it and I don't regret it. But $12.99, I can overlook some of those defects. But again, it's pretty glaring, especially this bar here. I don't know. The good thing is it's Leco, you can change it, but as it is, those are some of the defects and some of the things that I like about this set. So yes, I did buy it, I don't regret it, I will advise you to buy it if you had a Vespa, if you have a nostalgia for a Vespa. If a Vespa means nothing to you, then yeah, you don't need to get this set. That's it for me, for this set, that's the review. If you do like my videos, do subscribe. I have to get back to work on this and go back to work on my lego city till next time this is mesba take care stay safe and happy building